Doug Cars for MGLBlue.com at Yost Ice Arena, which will be vacant this weekend as the Michigan hockey team goes on a road trip, a very, very long road trip to Fairbanks, Alaska, as Michigan is taking on the Alaska Nanooks. A year ago, the Wolverines traveled to Anchorage, but it's the first trip for some young players. It's not just a hockey trip, it's an adventure. So what have the upperclassmen told you about Alaska? They just said, uh, long flight. It's nice to miss a couple days of school, but I mean, long flight, just got to stay focused and we're up there to get six points, so just stay focused. What do you remember about traveling to Alaska? It's long, long and tiring, especially the way back. I think it's like 24 hours of travel. It's a nightmare. Just the countryside is pretty beautiful. And then as far as hockey, good teams, strong teams, working hard. That's about it. What about Anchorage? You went to Anchorage a year ago. Is that a little bit more cosmopolitan than Fairbanks? Yeah, a little bit. Uh, you know, we got to go up and see some mountains. Uh, got to drive around, see some moose. So it was, it was fun. You know, we got to do that kind of stuff. I think we go curling in Fairbanks. That's our big excitement. You saw moose? Yeah. What would you make of the moose? They're huge. I mean, we know we used to see little deer on the side of the road, and there's a huge moose. I'm like, all right, yeah, it's in a different place. The Anchorage was beautiful, but I hear Fairbanks is just, just dark and lonely and scary and not really looking forward to it. Do you know where your, your park is, where your gloves and hat are? Not yet. I have to dig those out, look for them the next couple of days. So It's definitely a different world up there, uh, but uh, it's peaceful. So some people like that, and here, here's the city. Do you like peaceful or do you like the city? I like switching it up a little bit. In the summer, I go up north, so it kind of reminds me of that. But uh, during the year, I like it here. Tell us a little bit about curling. Are you good at that? I'm absolutely terrible. I'm miserable. Probably the worst guy on the team, actually. Um, but, you know, it's fun. We, we go out there and give it our best. Weren't you a multi-sport all-stater in high school? Uh, I mean, I don't know. <laughs> it doesn't translate, that's for sure. I think everything's a little slower up there. You know, I think everyone's in a rush here to get nowhere. But up there, it's nice and relaxed. And, you know, you get the beautiful scenery. And uh, it's, it's, it's a little more gray here. It's pretty gray here, but it was, it was, remember, it was really gray in Anchorage. I remember that. So... You're not going to go to Alaska, right? That's a guaranteed. I, I've got to go recruiting, Doug. I'd love to go to Alaska, but we've got to go find some players, so, and I have to do that. Are you sure you'd love to go to Alaska? I'd love to go to Alaska. Alaska is a, a great spot. It's a great trip for our guys. It's a good bonding trip, but uh, like I said, I'm going to go hit, hit the road and do some recruiting. Would you rather drive to Alaska? Would you do that? Uh, that's a long drive. No way, no way. I love driving, but I'm not going to drive there, so I think I'd jump on the Big Bird. You would do it for that? I would do it for that, yeah. yeah I, I enjoy flying, actually. Do you? I do. I do. I've flown uh, Europe all over the place, uh, so I, I don't mind flying. You're, you're, you're okay with flying now? I'm definitely okay, just, just like you are. <laughs> I don't like it either. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll sit together. The next time we go to Alaska, how's that? We'll hold each other. No, we'll drive together. <laughs> We'll get about a week start. So. Get some CDs and we'll make the drive together. Wouldn't be a bad trip. 